So Nick, there's only one place to start. Tell us a little bit about the goal out there. Uh, I feel like I feel like we had a, a great start to the game, and obviously it was really important for us to come out the second half. It's nice to get on the score sheet, but look, it's a team performance. As soon as it went up the pitch, I was. You make your own look, your own luck in football, and and that's what Leanne Ross just says to me as well. Is it's so true. So as soon as I, I got the ball, I just thought, have a crack at goal, and fortunately for me, it's went in. And but look, we've scored pretty early in the game, and we've managed to see out a fantastic result. And you're speaking a lot about the team, obviously. At the back, your defence, you kept a clean sheet today. Do you want to say anything about your teammates and how they performed? I felt I felt like Lee Alexander and our whole back four was excellent. Um, and of course, Emma Mitchell, who's slotted in at centre-back for us, who's the ultimate leader. Um, of course, she is for our club as well, but when she comes away to Scotland, she's she's fantastic in the back line and, and she uses her, her voice really well. But look, I can't single out anyone today because I feel like everybody was different class all over the pitch, first and second balls, and I mean, it was a really solid performance. And just finally, two of your teammates from club, Emma Watson and Chelsea Cornett, both made their Scotland debuts today. You must be delighted for them. Yeah, it's so deserved. I get to see these players day in, day out. Um, their work rate back at club is fantastic, but it's so nice to see young talents coming through the system as well who, who are fantastic. You've got Emma Watson, who's a fantastic individual, and you've obviously spoke about Chelsea Cornett, a club who's, I like to call the midfield maestro. She came on and tidied things up when it was needed. And look, both of them made an impact today, and it's so great to see. Nick, thanks very much and no well done again. Sophie, that was a great performance from you and the team out there. How did you find it out in the pitch? Yeah, good. I think um, the biggest thing is we wanted to get a result. Um, in the end, it didn't matter how. I think we started well. Um, and then when we when we scored the goal, it was more about defending that lead. And I think we did that really well. It was a massive shift from everyone. And I think in the end, we deserved the win. And at the back, it was obviously a solid defence from everyone there. In games like that, do you quite enjoy being able to really get stuck in? Yeah, I think that's a big part of my game. Um, I think everyone in the back line put a massive shift in and put their bodies on the line. Um, there were a few few blocks. Um, yeah, um, I think we dominated the battles. Um, we covered one another really well. I think um, that was something we wanted to do well is that back line coordination, and I think we managed that. And this game came at the end of a, a week of training so far. You must have been happy as well to just get out onto the pitch and really put into practice everything that you've been working on with Pedro and the team. Yeah, I think it's always exciting to meet up with our squad. We had a new couple of new faces, um, and I think they integrated really quickly and really well. Um, but there's no better day than game day. Um, as much as we enjoy training, we couldn't wait for today. Um, and I think it's nice that we rewarded ourselves with the win. And just finally, looking ahead to our next game against Costa Rica on Tuesday night, is it now just all about uh, getting recovery tomorrow and then back in the training pitch and being able to put on a show for the fans at Hamden Park on Tuesday? Yeah, 100%. Uh, now it's, as you said, uh, focus on recovery. And then um, we go again and we focus on Tuesday and we'll put another good performance in and hopefully another win. Sophie, thanks very much. Well Thank done you. again. Thank you.